A day after Deputy President William Ruto unveiled a task force charged with the mandate of reviewing forestry management in the country, the Ministry of Environment has officially launched a nationwide tree planting campaign with the aim of raising the acreage under forest from the current 7.2% to 10% by 2030 as required internationally. The team was in Gong Forest to kickstart the tree planting campaign where 10,000 seedlings were planted. Environment Cabinet Secretary Keriako Tobiko says they are targeting to plant 1 million seedlings in every county in the next five years. The new target date now is 2022. And this helps us now to galvanize the public away from this obsession with the 20, uh, 2022 politics. As the uh, Deputy President said, can we now start talking about 2022 as a target date? to achieve that and surpass the 10% uh, forest um, cover. According to the Cabinet Secretary, this exercise is not only going to involve government agencies, but every Kenyan has a role to play. Tobiko gave a warning to Somila who are against the 90-day ban on logging. Some of the licensed Somilas claim they had already paid billions of shillings to Treasury to cut down mature trees from some of the gazetted forests under the Kenya Forest Service. The cost to the present generation and to the future generation by these wanton destruction, reckless destruction of our environment cannot by any measure be compared with the inconvenience uh, or the cost incurred by these investors. Tumekua watu wa kutegemea bao. Nafikiri muelekeo huu utatusaidia sisi kama wananchi na wakenya zaidi kwanza kutazama mitazamo mingine ya namna ya kutafuta binu za ujenzi. Sio lazima tutumie mbao. The ministry is planning to launch a national tree planting day in April as part of its sensitization program to encourage Kenyans to plant trees in order to restore the water towers. Daniel Mule, NTV.